Net 201, Lan Wan. It's Thursday, week 12. Talked about security. <clears throat> we went through the whole thing. Okay, we started off, we talked about that balance between you know, maintaining business continuity, but yet securing the data, whether it's stored, moving, being processed. How do we do that? We do it with people and devices, products, procedures, policy, and guidelines. We talked about the physical infrastructure, hardware, the environment, electrical threats, and maintenance threats. Um, maintenance could be as simple as should you put an update in or not on a server? Have you tested it? The threats can be unstructured, very random, unstructured um, by anybody, or they could be very structured or very um, sophisticated in how they approach it, covering their tracks and so forth. They could come from external, or the threats could be internal. Your steps in developing your policy, you have to start out with a baseline. You create a baseline, you acquire the information, how much traffic, times a day, so forth. And you have a baseline on what you need to do when you configure devices to put them on. And then you have to audit, keep track of what is occurring. We had the question about securing at the application layer compared to securing through the network. So we talked about that quite a bit. We looked at the scenario here. I'm not going to go through all of this, but talk about all the different options for servers. Put those all listed there. <clears throat> and then we talked about securing at the edge. Being able to have a device contact a particular server of some type and then that server would decide if that port's available or not. So we're really securing things at the data link. Whereas if you are securing things, accessing a server, somebody's already on the network to one of those servers. We talked briefly about a DMZ zone for web pages, and we talked about some of the problems even there. If that web server isn't hardened and taken care of, Somebody could go to that web server to access and then use that web server to get inside. <clears throat> I mentioned briefly this whole idea of securing, bring your own devices, and so forth. <clears throat> we went over some of the network attacks. Reconnaissance. Reconnaissance can move from being legal to illegal ethical to unethical. Um, the internet supplies us all kinds of information, ping sweeps, port scans, packet filters, wire shard, those type of things. Access, we reviewed authentication, authorization, and auditing or accounting. Denial of service attack, we reviewed that, and then worms, viruses, and Trojan horses, we talked about that. Protection, switch networks, encryption, policies. Talked about the difference between host and server based security. <clears throat> and we finished up covering a little bit with intrusion detection prevention, passive or active, whether the intrusion detection is in line or not in line, whether it's host based or whether it's network based. And that is a short of it. And that's it.